Dana Brooke, the 24-7 champion, looking confident tonight. She's been doing a lot of talking from behind, but apparently not enough watching her back. The hottest potato in WWE being contested, the 24-7 championship. It's the best title ever, Michael. What other championship has been won by both me and Corey? Correction, Saxton. I won it. You stole it. Gosh, what impact! <laughs> Flying Mayorana! Oh my god, a DDT! Lights out. Scissor. Standing shooting star press incredible. Oh, round and round we go. Tilt the world head scissors. She's fighting back. As the challenger pinned, is this it? <laughs> Barely down for a one count. <laughs> Turning the tables. <laughs> Looks like Dana Brooke has a little swagger in her step tonight. Oh my god, a DDT! Lights out. Oh my god, a steel chair! Oh! An agile escape. Oh man! She did her homework there. Oh, to the body with the chair. Quick sidestep by Dana. Running Hurricane Rana. Fantastic. <laughs> and there's the reversal from Dana Brooke. Gary finds its mark. Ooh! Boom! Oh my goodness! Oh! Ooh! Expected that one. Up and down! What a slam! Kick right to the leg. Uh, uh, oh, a European uppercut. From the heavens, big body splash from the top. There's a takedown reversal. Dana Brooke wants to end this thing. This driver might do it. Boom, Samoan driver. Looking for the one. victory! Kicked out at one? Even the ref can't believe it! <laughs> and she denies Dana. Leaping into the wheelbarrow, yeah. up and around, oh. into the DDT! Ducks through, up and over, yeah. Selena Del Sol. Standing on production boxes and shipping crates, willing to f- She's gonna try it again. Uh, Stunner! Uh, emphatically uh, delivered. 
for the win. One, there's two. two. Three. And just like that, there's a new 24-7 champion. And a new superstar who's got to sleep with one eye open. Yeah, there's nothing like holding that title. You never get a moment to relax. Speak of the devil. And Dana Brooke might not be giving up either. The new champ better find a good hiding spot while she catches her breath. setting competitor. There are already plenty of accolades and a very bright future. The following is a fatal four-way Falls Count Anywhere match. And it's for the 24-7 Championship. Introducing the challenger from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, Aaliyah did not have a short or easy road to the main roster, but she is thriving now. Already a women's tag team title reign to her name, and much, much more to come. sight to see Katana Chance. She's always in a fun-loving, good mood. Yeah, a very high-spirited competitor as well. But once the bell rings, Katana needs to get serious. But don't let the big smile fool you. Katana is highly skilled inside the ring and in the air. You know what, guys? I'd be hard-pressed to name a woman with a brighter future, in my opinion, here in WWE. She's proven herself not just as a capable singles competitor, but also a tag team competitor as well. A great young talent with an extremely bright future. And introducing the challenger from Laredo, Texas, Roxanne Perez. Before she turned 21 years old, she had already won the first ever NXT Women's Breakout Tournament and the NXT Women's Tag Team Titles. And she has a bright, bright future. Superstar to compete on SmackDown, who was born after it premiered. Well, you're older than television itself, so I'll take your word for it, Saxton. It's the superstar who's driven to live up to all the hype. The champion 
from parts unknown, she is the 24-7 champion, the Diamond Sky. Here we go, gentlemen. Huge title match coming up and a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE right now. The ref holding this title longer than you did, Saxton. Four women in an all-out falls count anywhere match with a 24-7 title on the line tonight. In a chaotic match like this, I keep an eye on Katana Chance. Her quickness could be a real asset here. Come on, Saxton. There's a reason she didn't walk in here with the title, and a reason she's not walking out with it either. I'm betting on the champ to retain. Ooh! Tilt the world head scissors. Ooh! Oh, chip breaking uppercut. Uh oh, she's going to be setting up for a submission here. Uh, Black Widow! Locked in tight. Almost a miraculous escape and a side slam. Striking down with the axe handle. Oh, put down face first. Reverse up from Katana. A set up match slam. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Toss back into the ring. No count out as she takes this fight to the floor. Able to reverse that one. Malia gets met with a response. Solidified your name as a top athlete when you're able to pull off that move. And she slides her back to the mat. Standing Spanish fly, are you kidding me? Incredible. Agility like that is what can set you apart from the rest of the locker room. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. Great athleticism, backhand spring senton. And Takiri finds his mark. Ooh, oof. we are seeing on display here. She's staying elusive. Now oh, look at the point. Tilt to her arm drag. Boom! Boom! Head kick connects. Perez getting ready. On the buckle with a low drop kick. On the top. Oh, she lands her. What a face buster. She did. I don't want this match to end. 
behind. Elbow on the spot. Kick to the gut creates separation. I can't believe it. <laughs> Never saw it coming. Grabbing the arm. STO for the championship. And a shoulder is lifted before one. Incredible power to kick out at just one. And talk about giving it. Here's the pin title on the line. That could have been it right there. Oh, my God. Inverted Frankensteiner. And gets tossed back into the mat. Throws her back in from ringside. Across the middle rope, what's next? A body avalanche. And Tagiri finds his mark. Right to the midsection, sunset flip. A bad place to be for the challenger. This deep into a fatal four-way match, it's a wonder they're not more banged up. But the grueling nature of this match is definitely getting to them now, gentlemen. Russian leg sweep and the octopus strip. No! no. Aaliyah taking a moment to rub it in to let her opponent know she's not worried about it. Watch out! They're coming towards the announce desk! What the hell are you doing, Byron? That's another focused attack to her torso. Avoiding contact. to squeeze out the victory. Yeah, the other three competitors did not make this easy. I'm sure you're disappointed with that loss, but this is probably for the best. That's what you told me after John Buckley asked Jackie Hollier to prom instead of me. And I was right then, too. That John Buckley was bad news. He's an anesthesiologist now with a massive house outside of San Diego. And who wants to live there? Look, just like back then, this frees you up to focus and get to the level we both know you're capable of reaching. Yes, yes, I know. So no more 24-7? Fine. For now. You'll thank me later. <laughs>